If you've been waiting for the new Samsung Galaxy S22 device, then the team at Appalachian Wireless has some good news for you. Appalachian Wireless is launching all Samsung S22 models on sale. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. As temperatures rise and humidity drops, the National Weather Service has issued a red flag warning for our area. Tuesday, we spoke with Emergency Management Director Nee Jackson about the potential for fire danger. Basically, what's happening is um, with the dry weather that we're having, the wind, uh, the humidity, like for instance, tomorrow it's going to be uh, 20 to 25 percent. Right now, it's 30 percent. So we're getting close to the humidity level. Tomorrow, the temperatures are going to go from today being probably going to be a tops of about 50 degrees. Tomorrow, we're going to be pushing 80. So the temperatures are going to be higher. Um, they're looking tomorrow at winds 20 to 25 miles an hour for most of the day with gusts of up to 45 miles an hour. Uh, and you take that with the combination of like say the humidity dropping five to 10%, uh, the change in temperature and those wind gusts. So, you know, that creates a, uh, an environment for uh, fires to potentially grow uh, rapidly. With low humidity, it's advised for residents to delay burning materials until conditions improve. When there are red flag warnings, you don't want to burn at all. Uh, right now, it's 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. If, if they have to burn, uh, the biggest thing is try to hold off until we get a little bit more moisture, until the temperature changes. Uh, you know, there, there are a lot of things that people can do. Uh, me, myself, I, you know, I've got things that uh, at, at my house that I really need to get burnt, but I'm not going to burn them anytime soon until uh, the weather cooperates with us. And you don't want to burn, you want to have a contained burn area. You don't want to be within 150 foot of the woodland area. Uh, you want to have a good defensible space. So uh, you want to have some area around where you're burning at, preferably in a container um, so that, uh, you know, the fire is less likely of uh, escaping that as well. The red flag warning remains in effect till 8 p.m. Wednesday. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.